Hey everyone, welcome back and I am going to be going over my part three of the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty, what's going to be on sale, my recommendations, some thoughts, things like that. Alright, let's jump into this. So week number three starts on Sunday the 27th and the first product we are going to be talking about is from Stila and this is their Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. This one I always hear really good things about. I've actually, I don't think ever tried this product, but I really want to. So this one is a little bit intriguing for me. I really don't need any eyeliners to add to my collection right now. So that's what's kind of like really stopping me. It's originally $23 and it'll be on sale for $11.50. The next product that'll be on sale on Sunday, today when I upload this video, is from Bare Minerals. And I do really love their original foundation, but that one's actually not on sale this day, but their Mineral Veil will be on sale. So both their loose and pressed version of this product, I actually have like a little mini sample of their loose uh, Mineral Veil. And I, when I've been trying it out, it has been cold, it's been the winter time, so maybe I need to give it more of a try when it's warmer out, but with my dry skin, it's actually not my favorite. I don't know, I feel like that's a very unpopular opinion about this, but I will be passing on this one because I did get to try it out with this little sample. I've still got a ton in here to go through anyway, so. But if you are interested in this, it is originally 28 to $29. So half off of that, so what is that, like 14, 14.50, will be the sale price. Seven options here. So there must be a lot of different types of the Mineral Veil and I just have happen to have one of them. So maybe the, one of the other ones are better. Next is from Philosophy and it is their Hope in a Jar Smooth Glow Multitasking Moisturizer. I have tried a couple of their moisturizers before and I do actually really like them. Um, I really like the one for dry skin. I don't know if they still make that, but that one was my favorite. This one is originally $39 and half off it will be $19.50. Another Buxom lip product. <laughs> oh no, I might have to debate on either this one or the other Buxom product. Let me know which one you think is better. This one on Sunday is going to be their Full On Plumping Lip Polish and I think the one previously was their cream version. If you know what the difference is, let me know because that might help me out figure which one I want to go for. I am considering at least picking up one product, one of the lip products from Buxom during this sale. So originally it is $21, so on sale it'll be $10.50. This one is online only though. I usually do purchase from Ulta online normally, so that doesn't really affect me, but if you like to go in the store, then just keep that in mind. We have another Kopari product and this is their Exfoliating Crush Scrub and it is originally $39 and it'll be on sale for $19.50. Another online only one. I think I'm gonna pass on this one. I just feel like I can get drugstore versions that work really great, cheaper than even the half off price. I don't know, maybe it's worth it, but to me, I'll just stick to my drugstore one. Monday the 28th, we have another product from Peter Thomas Roth on sale. It is their Water Drenched SPF 45 Hyaluronic Cloud Moisturizer. I feel like I tried like a very little sample of this product before and I think I liked it. Normally it's $52, which is, I feel like a lot, um, but it will be on sale for 26. Also have the serum version of that product, which is normally $65, will be on sale for $32.50. Sticking with Monday still, we have a product from Origins, their Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask to Clear Pores, and this is originally $28, so it'll be on sale for $14. Last one for Monday is a surprise steal. Now wait a minute, I thought we were just doing surprise steals on Friday and Saturday, but this one is actually just for Diamond and Platinum members, so if you happen to be either of those statuses, you have actually quite a few surprise deals this day. There are three surprise deals, and I'm not sure what brands they're gonna be from, and they will also be online only, so I'm actually really, really excited to see what that's gonna be. Hopefully there's some good products. Tuesday, the 29th of March, there is another Urban Decay product on sale. It is their Hydromaniac Glow Tinted hydrator foundation. That took me way too many tries to say. Um, this one I'm actually very, very interested in. I've heard good reviews on this product. I have dry skin. I feel like this would be good for me and I do need a foundation. I think this one I'm going to get. I think for sure this is on my list. 
It's originally $29. It'll be on sale for $14.50. I feel like that's a really good price. If you have any opinions on that, let me know. Let me hear from you, especially if you have dry skin. Glam Glow also has a product on sale. It's their Bright Eyes Illuminating Anti-Fatigue Eye Cream. It is originally $39. It will be on sale for $19.50 this day. Smashbox has two products, two lip products that'll actually be on sale as well. Their Be Legendary Prime and Plush Lipstick, um, which is originally $24, will be on sale for $12, and that is online only. Um, so is the next product from them is also online only and it is their Be Legendary Line and Prime Pencil, Lip Pencil. And it's originally $19, so it'll be on sale for $9.50. Last product for Tuesday is from Strivectin and it is their SD Advanced Plus Intensive Moisturizing Concentrate for Wrinkles and Stretch Marks. And I actually have a little bitty sample of this one as well that I have not tried yet. Um, and again, like I feel like I've said in one of these other videos <laughs> for this sale is that Strivectin products just don't typically work for me. So I think that's why I've been putting off using this as I'm a little bit like nervous if that's going to make me break out or not. There's either two different sizes or slightly different products because there's a, a range here. So originally $79 to $139. So it'll be half off of that and it'll be online only. Moving right along into Wednesday, March 30th, they're going to have the Pure Cosmetics 4-in-1 Pressed Mineral Powder Foundation SPF 15. I've heard a lot of really good things about this, but I've also heard that it might not be the best for dry skin, so I'm not going to pick this one up, but if you have been interested in this product, it is a really good time to pick it up. It is originally $29.50, so it'll be on sale for $14.75, which is a good price. From Juice Beauty, another one that I have a sample of, like I have all these samples, I need to try them before thinking of purchasing anything. Um, I just, I have so many samples I need to, to get to that that's why I haven't tried them yet. I am doing the sample project pan this year to kind of help me work through these things, so hopefully I can get to these things a lot quicker because I'm doing that project. So let me tell you what this is. This is from Juice Beauty, and this is their Stem Cellular Anti-Wrinkle Retinal Overnight Serum and their Anti-Wrinkle Booster Serum. This is the, the booster serum. This isn't the overnight serum. The original price range here is $72 to $80, so it'll be half off of those prices. Next is from Paracomb MD, which I feel like is a very expensive brand, and I don't think I've actually tried anything from them no, I don't think I have. I might have some samples from them that, again, I just need to get to. They have select high potency products on sale. Um, these will be online only as well. There'll be seven different options to choose from, which includes moisturizer, serum, and cleanser. And the original price range of these products are $35 to $129. Wow, that's a lot. So half off of that. Next is by Dr. Brandt, their microdermabrasion skin exfoliant. I I feel like I have tried this in a deluxe size sample before and I actually think I liked this one. It, if I remember correctly, it's like really small, fine little um, exfoliants, but there's like a lot of them in there. So it really gets everything off your face. It's originally $79 on sale for $39.50. It's an online only sale. If I was in the market for an exfoliant, a good exfoliant, I would pick this up. But I have already picked one up this year and I don't think I need another one, so I will be passing on this, but if this is something that you have been interested in or you really like this product already, that's a good price to get it at. Oh, there's another one from the same brand and it's their Pores No More Pore Refining Primer. Um, I've never tried that product from them. It's originally $45 on sale for $22.50, again another online only sale. Um, I am looking for a primer, but I don't think I'm looking for a specific like pore filling primer. Thursday, March 31st, the MAC Studio Radiance Face and Body Radiant Sheer Foundation will be on sale. Originally $36, on sale for $18. I've heard good things about this, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be picking this one up or not. I feel like I'm a little more inclined to pick up the Urban Decay one that's on sale earlier in the sale, but if I can't get my hands on that, then maybe I'll try this one instead. I just feel like this one has a lot more sheer coverage than probably the other one will have. Kylie Cosmetics Matte Liquid Lipsticks are on sale, originally $17, on sale for $18.50. Philosophy, their Anti-Wrinkle Miracle Worker Plus Line Correcting Moisturizer will be on sale, 
originally $65 on sale for $32.50, an online only sale. Um, a couple more online only sales for Thursday will be the Zit Sticker, which I actually have a product from them that I purchased at I think the last 21 Days of Beauty sale from Ulta. Um, so select acne treatments from them will be on sale. I believe there's like three different options. They range from $16 to $36 originally. I believe this one is, which one is this? This is their Spot Clarifying Patch Kit. And I believe there were four in here and it ended up being like $8 when I got it or something. It's like two bucks per patch, which I thought was pretty expensive. I have tried it out. I do think it works well. I just think it's pretty expensive for each patch. I kind of feel like I, I have to like treasure these and not go through them so quickly just because of the price. Last one for Thursday is from Murad, AHA slash BHA exfoliating cleanser. And it is originally $44 on sale for 22, another online only sale. Okay, we're getting there. We're almost to the end. We are at Friday and Saturday. So again, we have some special deals going on, some surprise deals. Um, so Friday, Exuvians has a product, their Performance Peel AP25 and Pure Retinal Correcting Peel will be on sale, um, which originally ranges from $72 to $79, so it will be half off of that price. Benefit has the Gimme Brow Plus Tinted Volumizing Eyebrow Gel on sale. So tempted by this one. It is originally $24, so it will be on sale for $12. Ooh, I don't need any more brow products. I keep saying that throughout all of these videos, but that one is very tempting for me. That one the most probably is tempting for me. Um, I have been really enjoying like the brow mascaras and things like that, especially the tinted ones lately. I just finished one up. It was from Essence, so a lot less expensive. Works great. I could probably just go back to that, but it'd be cool to try out some other products that are similar. Sticking with Benefit, there's another product on sale on April 1st, and that is the Porefessionals Super Setter Pore Minimizing Setting Spray. I don't need any more setting sprays. This one is originally $32 on sale for $16, and it is an online only sale. So Friday also has another group sale going on. This one is an app exclusive, and it's their Conscious Beauty products select skincare. So there's 10 products a part of this sale, um, included in this sale, and they are from the brands Indie Lee, Kinship, Grown Alchemist, Volition, I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, Juice Beauty, and Lowly Beauty. I was kind of looking at the Indie Lee ones. I just tried an Indie Lee sample. I think it might have been a cleanser might actually be one of the ones that's on on sale and i thought it was really nice so i'm kind of interested in the brand now and seeing maybe if i can try out a couple of products for them so this one i am a little bit intrigued by we'll see if i pick it up i think there was a toner by them and i again like i've been saying i do need a toner so this might be the toner that i pick up um actually there's another one coming up that i will tell you about that i'm definitely going to pick up as well okay. Last thing for Friday is another surprise seal, and this one will be from Foreo, and those are normally like um, a skincare tool device for cleaning your face, I feel like. They might have some other products as well. I'm not really that interested in this one, so regardless of what they introduce for that day, I probably will pass on it. Saturday, our very last day of the sale. I feel like we actually have quite a few products here for the last day. We have Tarte Man Eater Mascara, originally $24, so it'll be on sale for $12. We have a Bobbi Brown product. We have their Vitamin Enriched Face Base Priming Moisturizer, which is originally $64, will be on sale for $32. That is a product that I would love to try out one day, but not today. I already am going to be purchasing a couple of other moisturizers from this sale, and I don't need to go crazy. But this is one like a more of a luxurious kind of higher end product that definitely would be nice to try. If it's something that you've been wanting to try or looking into, I would definitely suggest picking it up, especially at half off. Saint Tropez has a product, their Self Tan Purity Bronzing Water Face Mist is on sale, originally $30, on sale for $15. I don't tan <laughs> or do any of that. Um, but if you do, I think this is actually a really unique sounding product and I feel like that's a good price at half off for it. So um, if you've been wanting to try it or if it's one that you really like already, 
I would definitely recommend checking out the last day for that one. Lancome has a couple of select skincare products part of this sale on April 2nd and it is online only it is three products they're toner moisturizer and cleanser and the toner is actually one that I have purchased in the past a couple of times and I do really like it and for it to be on sale half off I'm definitely going to be purchasing this this is one of the toners that I'm for sure going to be getting during the sale Originally, these products range from $28 to $48, so it'll be half off of that. So I am looking forward to that product. That one is definitely on my list. An interesting product that is on sale, I guess it's not a product, but an item more so, is by Flawless by Finishing Touch. And it is their Flawless Beauty Fridge, <laughs> like a little mini fridge for your beauty products. I've seen so many people have this and I've been sent it um, from brands and things and I think it's kind of a very fun cool concept especially if you have the space for it like on a counter in the bathroom or, or somewhere else that you would store your beauty products. I think it's really neat that it's a different kind of product that they have um, a part of this sale and it's something that I don't think I've ever seen a part of this sale before it is online only. It is normally $59.99, so it'll be on sale for $30. And then lastly is another beauty steal for the very last day, and it is from Too Faced. So I am looking forward to seeing what that might be when it comes out on the very last day of the sale. So that is everything. Wraps up all of three parts of me sharing this Ulta 21 Days of Beauty sale with you. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Hopefully it was helpful for you. If you have been creating a list, a wish list of what you want to purchase based on all of these products that I have let you know are going to be on sale, let me know what that wish list is for you. Have you already purchased some of the products that have been part of this sale? If you have, what products are those? Do you have any recommendations for me, for anybody else, of what you would suggest to pick up from the sale? Please let us know down below and I will see you all later. I hope you all have a wonderful and beautiful rest of your day. Bye.